Hello, everybody. Welcome back. My name is Klaus. This is my house, and this is Witcher 3 Blood and Wine Expansion, not DLC. Anyways, we are uh, talking to Guillaume. If you haven't seen it in the last episode, I do recommend that you go through that. We went to uh, the house Bianco de Corvo or Corvo Bianco or those two words in some way related. And now we're talking to Guillaume, trying to help him out with Vivian. That Cupid's who shot you. But we got to train Sometimes first. Sometimes when you speak, I miss the meaning entirely. Yeah, that's because it's very backhanded. And you ain't so bright. Hey. These little kids sound like grown men. Like, hey, why'd you run into me, bro? Oh, God. Uh, we gotta shoot the blue one, eh? Hit the red targets. Oh, okay. Don't hit the blue ones, right? Um. Pretty fucking easy. Once more? Really? That's enough. Done enough shooting. Where to now? If you wish to know my thoughts, where are you? I would train on the race course ahead of all else. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's do the horsemanship. Riding. Roach will like that. Oh yeah. Excellent idea. A bit of a stretch his wigs. His widow waggies. Come with me. I'm actually in front of you, so you should probably run. The yeah. tourney's race differs from others you might have taken part in. You, you shall sure not ride against any opponent. How's it a race at all then? It's a race Just against time. time. Then, I guess. The true track begins in the arena, runs round the tourney grounds, then finishes again in the arena. The training track, however, lies beyond the arena. We shall go there now. Hmm. Yuki Duki. What about jousting? Is there like a joust that we could do? That would be pretty bad ass. I've always been a fan of a good joust. This looks like a starting line to me. <clears throat> All is ready. Now listen, for it can be quite a challenge. Along your route stand dummies and targets. The dummies you may cut with your blade. The targets you must hit from your crossbow. I fucking hate you. The time you have to complete the course shall increase each time you land a strike, be it with blade or bolt. It may sound simple enough, yet I've seen many a knight fail this contest and hang his head in shame. During the race proper, judges throughout the course shall tally your points. For now, you may ride unperturbed by those matters. Oh my god. I hope these are like far enough out. Is there like a... I don't see like a thing. But we could do this and remain uh Here we go. Oh, I missed it. That's okay. Is that it? I don't think that's so, going to be that hard to do. Or do you wish to ride again? Um, I think we're good. Had that wasn't enough. as bad as Probably I thought. Wear my horse down before the real race. Yeah, probably a good idea. Now? Well, the only thing left is combat training, so let's go ahead nice and do it, man. Do some footwork, work up a sweat. Very you well, Geralt. We should practice infantry combat one on one. Each knight opts for his own methods. Rainfarn, for instance, fights halberd in hand. Come with me. Well, we're obviously going to do swords because we're badass. You will badass. team with other knights to fight. The <clears> clash <throat> simulates a true skirmish during battle. Come the end, you shall fight a duel. It will determine your place on the podium. 
So I always like the girls the best. But now I can think only of my Vivian. In the end, it is good you will replace me. I sense I would simply be distracted this time. This guy is so lovesick. I feel like he's putting her up on this pedestal and he will be very disappointed. The North must be He needs to like Vivienne for Vivienne and not for just being obsessed with her at this point because she hasn't talked to him. She's a mystery and it boggles his mind. Stand at the center of the training ground. A knight okay. will approach and challenge you. Yeah, get ready to die, bro. You wish to spar? Why not? Yeah. Any last words? What's up, bro? Oh yeah? Do you like this? Oh! Oh. Done. I was I getting ready to go. You to do well, but not that well. Dude, I'm a witcher, bro. You want to fight? Could probably use some more practice. Usually fight monsters, not knights. Oh, they're kind of slow and stupid. All right, who uh, who, who the knights now? The Codex commands constant improvement. Pass, slice, smash. All right. Yeah. No mercy. Yeah. Is that the way you feel? I don't know if I can use magic or not. Oh! There's also like the uh, if you just block in time. Oh, there you go. I don't like that. I like this being uh, quick on my feet. Sorry, bub. I expected you to do well. Oh, don't, don't keep that saying well. that to me. I feel like we should just keep doing it, right? Because, uh... Could probably use some more practice. Oh, if they're gonna say the same thing, that's gonna be repetitive. Nice. But we get to fight a different guy each time. Like, he was a... he was a sword. Hey, ho, hey, ho. I will stand that fight, but be yeah. warned. I do nothing halfway. Yeah, okay. The last to do I will beat it out of you. Woo! Oh, back off. Back side. There you go. Oh, you got wrecked, bro. Do you wish to practice fighting a moment longer? Yes. Yeah, I just want to beat everybody. Could probably use. We'll skip through the uh, stuff we've already heard. Always with All right. Who is it? Ask me twice. There we go, buddy. All right, so you got a you got a shield. Not a fan of shields. You're not too strong though without it. There we go. Wow, two fucking hits. I expected you to do well, but not that well. Mm-hmm. Is there another one? Could probably. I mean, you can just sit here and slash people all day. Always with reason. Once we get to the same, I see. I can fight. I think it's just this guy, right? All right. Sorry, Bob. Yeah. No chance at all. I expected you to do well. Yeah. All right. I haven't seen the names repeat yet, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna keep, we're gonna keep going. Uh, I can fight. No, we just fought you. All right, I get it. Oh. We're just lucky this guy keeps missing. He keeps poking, but he's not getting that far. All right, we're all set. I expected you to do. Yep, I'm with you. All right, we've done this enough. Think I've, I've seen kicked enough. enough ass. Sorry to be blunt, but the simplest Witcher contract demands more skill than this kind of combat. That is so true, and I feel like I just witnessed now you that. Must go to the inscription tent. Honor and glory are all true and good, but your scrolls must be in order. That's tradition, right? Let's uh, let's head off that way, man. Go to the inscription table or inscription tent. I'm sure it's a table inside a tent, so it therefore would be an inscription table inside the inscription tent. Mm. 
most likely with an inscriber behind it. All right, let's see what's going on here. And there's a lot of wolf spain around here. That is actually very good. Uh, for certain things, you do need some wolf pain. I forget exactly what I think. Maybe uh, some of the stuff. Oh, what's this? I'm gonna read this. Uh, oh, so it's just people's names. That is a crazy script. I don't even believe that one down there at the bottom. That's just weird looking. All right, so it's just people's names. All right, let's uh, let's do this. Let's do it to it. We could loot. Attorney scribes notes. Uh, yeah. Let's read that crap. Uh, da 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 da. Participants registered qualified. Hmm. Oh, interesting. Wow, so this guy doesn't even have to uh, go. He, he just waits to the very end. Uh, Prince of Lyria and Rivia. Ooh. <laughs> oh, we get to take on our, uh, our better, as it were. Uh, as we are Geralt of Rivia. Uh, so, just like a little bit of history on everybody here. If you want to read this, you can always pause the video and, and whatnot. Uh, due to injury, Guillaume has transferred his place in the tourney to another knight, which is me. Let's get my Greetings. scrolls in order. Join the list. Naturally, we must first see to formalities, however. At Guillaume's request, I have looked into your personal history in its heraldic aspects. So, like, none. Really? What did you come up with? My findings show you may take part as Geralt of Rivia. Okay. What a surprise. Hmm. Or as the Honorable Ravix of Forhorn. What? It's not every year we have a combatant who can boast of two crests. Which do you prefer? Uh, what? What did you dig up about Ravix of Forhorn? Ravix of Forhorn? How did you manage to dig that up? Here in Toussaint, we treat heraldry very seriously. One visit to the Ducal Archives. That is all I needed to acquire the necessary information. Ravix of Forhorn was the name under which you attended a feast honoring Princess Pavetta, daughter of Queen Calanthe of Sintra, on the occasion of her 15th birthday. Ooh, that's actually right. Hmm. He's like, uh huh, don't so. And uh, what about Geralt of Rivia? Kind of curious what you could have learned about Geralt of Rivia. In the year 1267, a certain Geralt, a member of the Witches' Guild, was knighted by Queen Meave and dubbed Geralt of Rivia. This was in honor of his distinguished service at the Battle of the Bridge, said structure spanning the Yaruga. But I wager you know of which battle I speak. Very true. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, those were the days. Kahir and I led a fistful of Nordlings against an entire Nilfgaardian battalion. Won that battle just because we absolutely had to cross the river. Alright, I want to be Geralt as Rivia because I'm Geralt as of Rivia. Come on, guys. I'm Geralt, not about to fight under a false name. You may now take the shields bearing your crest. I'm a witcher. Shields aren't something witchers ever use in combat. Who mentions using it in combat? Not I. The shield commemorates your participation in the tourney. You may take it as a souvenir. Sounds pretty baller to case, me. Thanks. Have you been instructed as to the tourney's challenges, prizes, and vows? If not, I do hope you will allow me to tell you about them. Um. Uh. Sure. What's with the challenges? I think we kind of already know, Guillaume but it's always good to get more information. Contests. Rather make sure I'm clear on them, though. An admirable thirst for knowledge. There are contests three: a shooting range, where you will compete side by side with an opponent; a horse race, during which you will seek to complete the course within a specified time. Any targets hit with bolts or dummies felt with blade will increase the time you have. Finally, the group melee in the arena, crowned with a duel against last year's champion. As each contest ends, its results will be posted on the board outside my tent. This way, all will be apprised of who leads at any given moment. Convenient. 
All right, and what about these prizes? Gonna come right out with it. I'm a sucker for prizes. <laughs> the winner of each contest shall receive a trophy. Whoever has the best result once all contests have played out shall face last year's champion uh, in cool. a final duel for glory and the title. Should you Not defeat bad. the reigning champion, the grand prize will be yours. This year, a sword forged especially for this occasion by the one and only Cornelius of Asengard, a famed master weaponsmith. Ooh. Her illustrious highness had it brought all the way from Nazar. I'm down for swords, man. All right, and uh, yeah, what are the vows all about? We, we check the other stuff. We might as well check this out. Vows? As is our custom, knights make vows to which they hold for the duration of the tourney. Each swears on something which to him represents his most cherished virtue. Okay. Sounds great. Feels like I know everything I'd ever want to know about chivalric tourneys. Splendid. In that case, you must make your vow. Upon what would you like to swear it? Um... Swear on, a, on the heron, on my lady's love... I'll swear on her illustrious highness's garter. Um, three would be funny. Uh, I think we went full way with, with Yennefer, so I guess we can do that. Even though I regret that. Yeah, we'll do it on the love. I vow on the love of my lady. Yennefer of Vengerberg, to respect the chivalric virtues. May the gods succor you in your endeavors to overcome. A sign here, please, then fill out these forms. These guys are using some good vocab. That is sucker all means help, I by the way. From you. Now, Not like you're a sucker. By Guillaume, you shall be fitted with appropriate armor it's a very old tour. word, though. Not often used. Hmm, shiny. You have also been assigned a tent for the tourney's duration. It stands near the arena. Good luck. Well, thank you, sir. All right, so it looks like we're uh, we're all set there. Eh, you know what? You look okay, girl. You look okay in that. I think your glasses make you look a little bit less badass, but um, not too bad, all in all. I just wanna just wanna take a look at this. Uh, oh, so this. Armor is actually kind of better. Richard gear is zero of six. Item must be upgraded to Grandmaster level to unlock bonuses. Oh, interesting. So that looks like it's actually something new. Cool. Uh, so this stuff can't really do anything fancy with it, but that's perfectly fine. Uh, we got that bonus gold. We got the uh, first. Yeah. So this is like an awesome one. Uh, all right, cool. So we look like we're all set here. Uh, I do want to give myself a little uh, game saving moment. Uh, so this should have my name on it now. Geralt. So that's how you say Geralt. All the way down at that bottom one there. Interesting. Let's uh, let's make our way. See what we can get done. All right, let me through. Gerald of Rivia coming through. A little, a little dark, don't you think? Just gotta shoot the red ones, right? Geralt, well, I'll be. Have you decided to turn knight errant? Sure. All jesting aside, here on a job. You in the twenty two? Am I? Ha! I shall square off against Rain Farn of Atre. I saw him just moments ago, a nervous wreck, stuffing his nose with fish tech, no less, as if that would aid his determination. Guessing <laughs> that's against the rules. But who's to tell the Nefgardian what to do? Right. Listen, Geralt, I have a tip for you. The timing of your marksmanship duel is such that you shall have the sun in your eyes. Makes no difference to me either way. Nor will it give you any pleasure. Since, as it is, we must both wait, play me in a round of quint. Should you win, I shall swap with you. To me, a southerner, the sun is no hindrance. 
you know what this means, everybody. We're actually going to take a little bit of a break here from the episode. Well, it's been 20 minutes. Why not? Why not? We'll just end it here. Um, I'm going to end, or not end, I'm going to start this Gwent match, and uh, we're going to be reviving that Gwent series, guys. So probably every Sunday or so, something like that. You might have already seen the videos come out. I'm not sure how many people I'm going to be playing in Gwent so soon. But anyways, I hope that you've enjoyed this episode. When you come back next time, you will see us take part in the tournament. And uh, maybe we'll have the sun in our eyes. Maybe we won't. That is for you to find out as well as myself. If there was anything about this episode that you did enjoy, let me know down below in that comment section. Otherwise, have a great day, great night, whatever it is to you. And I will see you back here next time for some more Witcher 3 Blood and Wine.